The what? The Mandalorian ship. Please don't crash. What about gotcha. the baby? That's true. The boy. The boy must be safe. Okay. We are live. You can probably text back Aunt Megan if you want right now while we wait. Okay. Or I can, but I'm telling the Discord that I'm live. Okay. At everyone, it's time for women. Okay. No, we're not playing the viewer. Can we remove that tag, please? No, not edit profile. Ah, I'm panicking, panicking. Do you have a favorite you would like to tell us? Do I have a what? A favorite food. I don't have a favorite okay. food. But, I mean, if you want to. Tell her anything you can. I did. I said one of my favorites is mac and cheese and one of Matt's is. I don't have a favorite. Oh, somebody's already here. Is it me? Oh, it might be my... Hold on. If you're here, say something. Tell me. Speak your truth. Well, that's what we do on International Women's Day as we speak We our speak truth. our truth on International Women's Day. Now, I should have some music in the background, but I don't know what music to do because copyright concerns, you know? We'll do like Nintendo music in the background or something. Nintendo has music? Yeah. Hmm. Two I hours of fresh Nintendo music I found in my fr This one? No, they're just like or any of them. They're both cute. That's fair. Mark is red. Cool. You can hear the music now? Me? No, I'm talking to the chat that isn't talking, but that's okay. It's okay, you don't have to talk. I know you're here, and that's what matters, you know? That's what that's what counts in life. But feel free to participate, whether or not you are woman. Should I not look right now? Um, it doesn't really matter, but it's up to you. Opening my Reese's cup. The Reese's cup small, which is the perfect proportion of chocolate, is a peanut butter. Wow. The best ratio. They said get ratioed. Reese's cup. All right, well. Welcome to International Women's Day. How Hi. do you feel as a woman? Um, as a woman, I am so glad that we have this day and day month to reflect on women's history and the impact women have made throughout the world. I don't know if it read the thing out loud, but thank you for subbing. Thomas, how are you? It's been a minute. How are you doing? How's life? I'm sorry I haven't been streaming as much and or focusing. Do you like that thing that I did where I asked a woman to speak and then ignored what she said and talked to a man? Um, how are you doing? Good to see you. Um, just You're in for a weird one today. I'll tell you that much. Is this the women? No. On this because I see a page, Sailor Moon woman. there are two women that are actually in the slideshow on oh. this page. This I didn't is, plan that. It just kind I, of happened. I just didn't even know there was this many anime women. There's always more anime women. Why? There's always more. <laughs> Which two do you think are the ones on the slideshow? The show? Sailor Moon one. Which Sailor Moon one? There's more than one Sailor Moon one? Yes. Oh no! The one that looks like she's in a Sailor Moon one. And like this, no, in the back. Oh, that one? no, I didn't see Or do you mean Moon. Sailor Moon? I meant the one in the back. What do you anticipate? What do you, I have 50 waifus here. What What do you think, who do you think will be on this list? Me. 
No, these are fake wipes. Am I actually not in this PowerPoint? I didn't think about that. Oh my god. Because you're my wife. You're not my wife. You're my love. My darling. My angel. My wife. <laughs> okay. I felt like you would feel weird about being in this. That's fair. Um, I guess I expect some Sailor Moon. I know a couple of them. Yeah. Because I you you were making this while I was literally one foot it's away true. from you in our it's bed. True. As a married couple. It's true. Um so I expect some say I don't remember which Sailor Moon is your fa favorite. I know that that's not. I don't remember what Sailor Scout is. Your yeah, favorite which Sailor Moon is your favorite? Property. Do you like Sailor Waxing or Sailor Waning? Shut up. <laughs> Mine is I Sailor prefer, Blood. <laughs> I like Sailor Waxing Gibbous, please. <laughs> Um, I expect that. I expect some from your weird video games. I do not expect weird Egyptian girl from your weird No, because games. she's ugly and dumb and I hate her. Um, so I expect some from Doki Doki and okay. some from that game I've never seen you play, but I know you did a report on it. About- Oh, the, the yeah, the, date, the dating game. Yeah, he did a video report on one. Katawa Shoujo. Sure. Which translates to disability girls. Um, okay. Um, I know this started with Pokemon. Yeah. Um, so I expect some Pokemon. I expect some Disney. Um, I know there I are no that, yeah. live action women. Correct. No real women. Only so fake we women. Establish the rules so when no one hears them <laughs> later on, we can go. No, let's get the rules. What? Yeah, the rules are they're not real women. They're not based on real women. They can't be a live action like character because yeah. your attraction would be based on the attraction of the, the actress, and that's a real woman. All of these are people that I'm attracted to because of the character design of the character. How they are created. I will also say there are a couple that are more out there okay. in terms of if you're a good little Christian boy or girl, maybe. Just be aware of that. Does the young... Um, and there is only one lolly. Does voice acting... <laughs> so I just have to say this? that. Um, not really, no. That's cool. Why? I don't know. I was just wondering. I was Anyways. Just... Wanted to contribute. We should go for it. We should just go for it. Yeah, because I got I gotta go. I, I separated gotta these all so. into segments. We're doing we shop music while we do this. That's it's great. This how we should treat women. That's right. Hi Cuttlefish. Hi Ryan. Happy birthday to all women. A lot of them have pink hair. This is just anime. No one I know that, but cool. a lot of them have pink hair. Welcome just to International to... Women's Day. So we start with the Pokemon girls. Now, oh, I, no. I did a little slide to introduce them all. Okay. Um, and in that slide, I realized I can put more than 50 women because I'll just include ones that are honorable mentions in the Pokemon girls. Oh, okay. Um, also, I'm sorry to Cuttlefish and any other fan artists. It was you a lot. I just kind of grabbed a lot. There are some that I will credit because I love their art. Um, I also realize that you probably can't see some of these because we're covering them. This Oops. is May. You but in a cute little that. skirt. You did that when we looked at. Yeah, the I didn't think about it yeah. until I was like ten slides in, and then it was a problem. <laughs> so anyways, like ten this is May in a cute. Oh, trust me, it took me a long time to make those ten slides. Okay. Uh, this is May, cute little skirt. I like her. I, why didn't you just do OG May though? Uh, because I don't like her weird gym shorts. Does she wear that in the anime? No. At all? Okay. I like her face and I like cute little outfits. They're like not all hair? wearing real outfits. Let's be clear do you like about her that. Weird bangs. So sure. she has bangs and then like. More bangs. Sure. Um, this one's Hilda. I don't like that fan art, I'm sorry. Yeah, it's not the best fan art, but she um doesn't usually wear a skirt, and I saw her in a skirt and I said, nice. Where she usually she wears from? tiny little shorts. She She's from Unova. Black and white. Uh. Black and white. And then these are girls, they're just a NPC trainer in um X or Y and they're beautiful. The France one? Um this one is from Sun and Moon. Is that from the France one? This is the France one, oh, yes. Cool. This is the Alola one. She's one of the Elite Four members. Oh. Um, What's her type? She's flying thing? type. Oh, that's fine. Because her stick matches the two cannons beak. Oh, but why a golf stick? Because she's a golfer. That's her role. That's what she does. She plays golf. Look, I just like her tiny little skirt, okay? Alright. Um, this is Rosa. She's black and white twos protagonist. Okay. And this is just a cute art. And then this is another May, because I also thought this was cute. Uh, this doesn't even look like May. Sure it does. Okay. Sure it does. Anyways, first one. Um, Classic. I will just say the middle art is uh, not high qual highest quality it could be, but I, I liked yeah. it too much to say no. I, I like that we're at least respecting her classic outfit. Well, yeah, because it's great. No, we're, don't ball. quote it's that. Cool. Don't quote that, Ryan. What do you say? Uh, a quote from a oh. long time ago. That is iconic. We should get more quotes though. That we need to work iconic. on quotes. We will more. Need to stream more oh, we got more than 300 followers. That's new. That's, That's pretty cool. Neat. 
Um, yeah, so that's Misty's OG design. It, I mean, it's yeah. great. What is not to love about no, that? No, it's amazing. It's iconic. It is the moment. And it's cute. It's cute tomboy. And then this is her new design from the latest games on the left. I like that one too. You'll notice a trend with these women. This is the really rare crop tops and skirts? Yes. All right. Th this is a very obvious right. trend. <laughs> Continuing on to number two. This is Gloria. Okay. She's our girl from Sword and Shield. What? What are you Just okay? The bits. The what? The bits. What about the bits? The bits could be showing. They could be, but they're not, are they? Yep. Um, and that's her and Marnie's jacket, because it was cute. I don't know. Oh, are they dating? Uh, in can in canon, no. Dang. In fanon, yes, they're lesbians. I together. love that for them. Um, that is a big thing. That's pretty cute. How do I not have a pick of Misty in a kimono? Because I didn't think That's about true. that. Misty in a kimono She's is a kimono amazing. Girl. We saw that episode, didn't we? Yes. It was like at the end of one of them. And yeah. she shows up in the Nash goes, Aw. But it doesn't do anything for Brock. Because no. Brock is a grown man. And, and he's he only says, attracted to grown women. I'll take the grown women, please. Um, also, these aren't in a particular order until the last few. Okay. I always put my favorite of each of these. So we're not ranking these women. Gosh darn it, we got this again. Can somebody, um, can somebody un put, like, ban the words, like, I don't know, uh, ban the word, I don't know, doge whatever that was. I just, we keep getting bots. Anyways, yeah, so these are fine women. They're just not ranked in any particular order. She is cute. Sonya, really like she's her. very cute, and I and like- Does she wear the crop top in the yes. actual game? Oh, so okay. she wears the big poofy jacket yeah. the whole game, and then at the end, you'll see, she takes off the big poofy jacket and puts on a lab coat, and then shows that she's- A boss? Showing more, and I'm like, ooh, I like that. I don't get this part of it, but it was just, it was a nice fan art, so I ignored the, the shirt Women's and the shoes. Day to every girl boss. Every girl boss. She is girl boss. She is girl boss. She is girl boss. So that's Sonya. Next is Chloe. She's the newest anime girl, and I just think she's kind of cute. Her hair doesn't seem real. No, she's an anime girl. Also, she's a girl. And she has good fashion sense, and oh. I think she's a cute. And she has the Eevee that won't evolve. I do like that the Eevee is helping brush. Yeah. You couldn't find any fan art of her? Um, no. Okay. There's not good fan art of her. Like, good as in good quality or uh, yeah. appropriate? As in, as in, like, decent looking. She has appropriate, like, a variety of outfits. Yeah, and it's great. That. I love that it. It's cool. cute. This isn't, none of these are her main one, because her main one's a weird dress with a weird design that looks oh, weird, okay. and I don't like it, and it's weird. That's okay. Don't worry about it, Ryan. Um, all right, number five. We have Iono. Um, I don't feel bad about the one on the right because it's AI generated. And they don't need any credit for it, but she's streamer. Girl. What? What? Nothing. Speak your truth. No, I don't have any. There's a lot of boo. Sure. On, the right, on the but right, but yeah. Yes. yes. But I don't know. She's a little streamer girl. She's cute. Yeah, Ryan likes her. I know. Oh, good. I don't quite get her, her hair outfit. Doesn't work. How does her hair work? What do you mean? Like, why does it come down to nubbins? Uh, because anime. Oh, okay. I forgot the anime. Right is a little spicy. It's not the spiciest one on this list. But it's up there. Um, so yeah, if you don't want spicy, be aware. She's just cute and she has like little teethies and she goes, I was gonna say, it's convenient you can't own. see her weird, creepy No, you teeth. can! She has little fangs in the middle I one. Like I like fangs. her fangs, they're cute. All right. So yeah, that's Iono. Um, now we're getting to the top five of my Poke Girls. Oh, okay. This is Jasmine. She's great. Is I love she Jasmine. From? She's from uh, Gold and Silver. Oh, okay. She's a steel type trainer and she's just very pretty. She has a pretty little dress, and she's very pretty, and I like her. Golden Silver was the first game you could play as a girl. It's true. No, Crystal was. You're right. That's what you taught me. You're right. I don't right. quite get her hair, but That's she's fair. pretty. I don't get so, it either. I don't know. If you don't have much to say, we no. can move on. Uh, this is Marnie. Is she number four? Yes. The bits need to be covered. No, this is number five. It was top six for this one. Oh. Yeah, but consider if they aren't. I like the left one because she's fully clothed and as women we shall not show off our bodies. That's a fan art and I like, I like, I just liked this art of her. I like this outfit. That is a cute outfit. outfit. Um, I hope and everyone's then, aware I'm not shaming her. And then this is very this much mommy. Mo sorry, mommy, Mommy's sorry. Great. And then this is just, I think also AI generated, the one on the right. That's pretty big. Which is very weird. These three. It is a really good art. It is a good. Which is a shame that the bots AI made it. Um, but it's nice and I like it. And I think she's cute. Uh-huh. This is Dawn. Ah, 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 <laughs> did not like that for a second. I don't know if that came on the couch. This is Dawn. But... These aren't the best fan arts of her, but mm, it was hard to find them. Some would say they are. Um, well, I mean, it's covered. Yeah, from this angle. Yeah. 
Um, I don't love this outfit on the left, but it's kind of cute. I don't like it. Well... It's her, like, platinum outfit. Oh, so she's, like, in I a winter it, coat. Yeah, I assumed it was, like, her winter outfit, and it's no. fine. Well, so why is Dawn better than May? Why is Dawn better than May? Because Dawn's person. default outfit has a skirt. Okay. That's the answer. Do you want the answer? That's no, the answer. that was the answer, I guess. Um, and yes, these are safer than a lot of the art mm -hmm. on the internet. Um, I don't think her skirt is that short in game, though, on either yeah, of these. Yeah, like, I this sure is pretty hope tiny. not. I, it's Pokemon. You never know. That's fair. No, Misty's shorts are surprisingly short. You do lots of research. Saying. Okay, good. All right. <laughs> Brian said if I need help finding art, let him know. Okay. Uh, so that's Dawn. And then we get to number three out of the top. Number three. Th three. Three. Yeah, number three. It's, uh, it's not happy. It doesn't like all the things happening. This is probably. leaf slash green. Oh, okay. So I must explain. You have a comic. I have a comic, a manga. And oh, she's in it. Manga, and she's cute. I and I love her. Manga. Um, this is leaf. So she was first in leaf, fire red, leaf green, right? Yeah. In the middle design. Oh, was she in sun and moon on the right? Well, so red and blue came back for sun and moon. Oh. In the games. And they did not bring leaf back because she's not the original pair. She's like yeah. an add-on. Yeah, she's add like a weird third party. But fans were like, no, she should come back. And so they gave her this grown-up design because Ash and or red and blue are yeah. kind of grown-up. And so they gave her that grown-up design. I like it. Which I think is very cute. It's and I like, cute. I think her shirt says 04, which is the year Fire and Leaf Green oh. came out, I think. But it's like a super cute Alola art. And then the one on the left is her from the manga and she's yeah. spunky and sassy. She and is. I read She it wears a tiny little dress and I love way her. Way back when. I was like eight. But I've always I've always enjoyed her default fire red leaf green outfit. It's just a shirt and a little skirt. She has really long socks, but those are fine. Those are just socks. This number two? Number two. This is the X and Y girl and I'm in love with her. Oh, okay. Um, from the moment she was revealed, I said I love her. Oh, okay. I don't know why her socks are so shiny Remain in all of these arts. Pro tag? But, mm -hmm. Okay. And you can style her and put her in whatever clothes you want. Well, it's that great. is a great game. Um, but I just that like her default outfit. I think it's great. The old high-waisted skirt. Um, and then also, I don't know what the one on the right is from. I think it's like something like contests or there was like, there was something either in the games or the anime where she, in the anime, she wanted to be a contest girl. Mm -hmm. And so she, she cut all her hair off and it looks worse and I hate it. Um, but then she also like put on a bunch of like, contest outfits and stuff and that's one of them and that's a cute outfit too that's a cute one. so that's serena that's fun i guess i just feel like she has different personalities in each of these uh, yes images. i think part of that is because a i guess she's your character in she's serena. your character yeah. so people kind of decide and b um in the anime they made her very like i'm a girl ha ah, ha and in the games she's more just like no, I'll, I'll kick your ass if I need to, like, you know? All right. So, yeah, that's all. And then my number one Poke Girl. do you know who it is? Even if you can describe her? Crystal. It's not Crystal. You probably don't know who it is. It's Lily. Lily's from Alola. She has an awful haircut. Which is Sun and Moon. Okay, but consider that she starts out on the left. No, and that's in her she little has white dress. Hair in the left. And it's fine. She has a big floppy hat and she's kind of cute. Yeah. Right? Yeah. But then she has this whole story arc of her mother doesn't love her and she was not abused, but like basically abused as a child, neglected. And so she's like, I'm gonna be a new person and be me. And she comes out in that. And when I played the games, I was like, cute. I would have said, go back, your hair is bad. I didn't think about the hair, but look at her cute little outfit. It's a little sailor uniform, and I love it. Um, does she have a problem with her knees? No. Then why can't she stand up straight? Because she's uh, has to cover her bits. Oh, I You see how it's bits. flowing up a little bit. She's got to cover them, you know? What about on the right? On the one on the right, she's just cute. She's just admiring the ocean. What about it? Kawaii. Kawaii desu. So that is the Pokemon girls. All right. Thank you, We're Pokemon. We're fifth of the way there. Thank you, Pokemon. Also, for anime your girl. I don't know what you mean by this. That one gym leader and they're, also anime girl. They're explaining. It's. I was making a joke about the legs, and it's because they're an anime girl. Oh that yeah, that's fair. Like that. Yeah. Okay, cool. So the next category <laughs> is Danganronpa. Oh boy. What? Just no oh, boy. Okay. What do you think of these women? Um, they're all very different, but very strong and beautiful women. Oh, that's lovely. Uh, not the, not this one. This one's Junko Enoshima, the ultimate despair. She oh. plunged the world into chaos. We don't stand her. She is gatekeep girl boss 
Gaslight. Gaslight. All three of those. All right. In fact, most of these girls on here aren't. This is Sonya. She's a princess and she's cute. This is Maki. She's a child caregiver, but really an assassin. She's cute. This is Junko. She's hot. Mommy, sorry. Um, also, this art is one of the artists I follow on Twitter. Cruz with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven views. Ryan recommended her to me. She's a little, she's a Latina girl, I think. She's Spanish. She's very good at art. And then this is Mew. Mew is also mommy, sorry, mommy. Uh, but she's also very crass and um, very outspoken about her um, sexual desires. And so she's a bit much. You are having the time of your life. I can see it in your eyes. This is exactly how I wanted to spend International Women's This is also day. the best pose that anime girls can be in okay. on the right when they tie their hair and their uh -huh. shirt peeks up a little bit. Uh -huh. Iconic. Amazing. Amazing. What if they're in a dress though? Um, well, it's not as fun then. Oh, this God. is Ibuki. Ryan likes Ibuki. Is she the ultimate guitar? She's the ultimate musician. No, she is the guitar. She she does the guitar, yes. It's like how some of the women in here are gonna be just swords, so. Yeah, um, these are all, the one on the right is what she looks like in game. Mm -hmm. um, but then these are just fan arts of her that I think are cute. I do, I love the energy of the center one. Like it's, yeah, it's, it's a very, very well, awesome. very good figure drawing. Like they did a good job with it. She is unfortunately in the game a little lol XD, um, mm, where she's like lol that. random XD. Um, she would go. To there's like a topic. scene where she's like, "I'm gonna bite you," and your character's like, "Please don't." And then she's like, "I'm gonna bite you now," and he goes, "Stop biting me." Yeah, she would go to Hot Topic and she would live in there, but she's cute. <laughs> Consider, Consider that she's cute, and she has a lot of like. I don't know. I don't normally go for the hot topic type girls. That's fair. I'm but... just fascinated by how every hair is different texture. Yes. I'm just actually it, like mesmerized by how each of them has different texture. That's fair. Anyways. That's Ibuki Miyota. Next. Tenko Chabashira. I've never seen this one. The one on the left is not a great art of her, admittedly. She doesn't look very she cute in it. She's a plant girl? She is not a plant girl. I have talked about her before because she does something that you did. What? Uh, it's, a, it's a Reese's cup. Brain. She's the Aikido girl. No, I gathered that. Um, she hates men, but that's Same. fine. We can get over that. Um, and I, I can you take you. a guess why I like her? Maybe because she's dominating? No. Oh, well then. It's because she wears a tiny shirt and a tiny skirt. Oh, And that's she's it. cute. I don't know what, what what's going on with her hair, but yeah, it I is what it like is. It. As someone who has done Aikido, I can tell you that has nothing to do with Aikido. Well, yeah, this outfit is terrible for Aikido as well. Correct. But consider that it's cute and that she's cute, even though she's an awful character, really. Oh, my bad. Um, but she's cute and I like her. Then we have Kyoko Kirigiri. The one on the right is probably the closest to what she actually looks like in game. Okay. In terms of length of things that she wears. All right. Um, what what say ye? What do you think? Is she mean? She's distant. Is she like Hana, ha, ha, Hanajima? No, she's like... I don't know if there's a character in that show that she's like. Is she like Eska? Kind of, but not like mean. She's just kind of like down to business. She How like, would you describe her? She She's like, blunt, yeah. She like Zuko? She's very like, I'm just gonna tell you like it is. Oh, Zuko's girlfriend. Yeah, that's fair. She's kind of like my... I don't remember. Anyways, I like her, um... I'm scared not I like her boots, and I like her little skirt. And she has pretty hair. Yeah, this is a weird remix of Dire Dire Docs. It's not from Galaxy, though. It's from 64. Oh, I'm so smart. Um... But yeah, she's cute. I wanted to get her anime design in too, because there's an anime that they're in too a couple years later. And she wears like a like a suit, like a business suit, and a, just a tiny, tiny little pencil skirt. But um, I couldn't find any art of that that wasn't too horny. So um, here we are. Why does she wear gloves? What is she? Uh, well, she's the ultimate detective, but that's a spoiler technically. Oh, my and God. she wears gloves also a spoiler because she, when she was young and new at detectiving, she burned her hands really bad. Why would you do and that? And so her hands are all scarred and so she wears gloves. And it's actually like a relevant, like a very relevant plot point for a couple of the trials. 
Why would you do that? Um, because her family is a lineage of detectives, but her father abandoned her to go run the high school of Danganronpa. Um, and then she later sees his bones. And that's how her hands got burned? No, in the game you see his bones. His bones! Anyways, that's Kyoko. And then, last but not least, my number one, oh, wait, my got, OG, like, my amazing love of my life, Danganronpa girl. It's Sayaka Maizono. And I love her. I love all of her. I love everything about her, except her voice. Her voice is terrible. She sounds 40. I hate it. But she's the cutest she's in the whole world. The Illy thing. Yeah, because she's a K-pop. She's a J-pop girl. Uh, Can you tell by her right side official art? That's official art? I think it's official art, yeah. Jeez Louise. What? Oh, she's a singer girl? She's a. She's literally the ultimate pop sensation. Is she in a group or is she's she in just a girl group. her? Okay. She's in a girl group, yeah. So why is she the ultimate one? Um, right. Because she's the lead of the girl group. It's like if they picked Jimin to uh, be the ultimate K-pop boy. I don't know anything about K-pop. I'm sorry if that's incorrect. Um, it's like Diana Ross and the Supremes. Sure. It's All like right. Harry Styles and One Direction. Let's be real. The whole time it was One Direction, it was Harry Styles. Yeah. Um, the one on the left, she doesn't actually show her tummy, but I that thought it was cute. That just looks like Sailor Moon. The one in the middle is so cute. Yeah, I don't know what these are. I don't know why they're called Sailor Outfits. That's what they go to school in. They have yeah. those in, in- But why are they called in, sailor outfits in, 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 in Fruits in Basket? Yeah. Fruits Basket. Um, I don't know why they're called sailor outfits, but they're they great like and they're amazing. Yes. They're great and they're amazing. All right. Um, we love a good sailor outfit. Matt but, looks at sailor outfit and goes, I don't know why it's called a sailor but outfit. I also like, but I also like her little pop outfit because because boots and because midriff. Do you ever see her as just a normal pop star or is she always in Murder H Hunger Games school? Well, the game takes place in Murder Hunger Games school, so you don't see any of the stuff that happened before. Well, that's rude. It is rude. It's, How do you it's get so rude. Touch to these characters if we only know them in Murder Hunger Games school? Well, because you fall in love with them because they're cute and then they get they're the first one murdered and, and you say, "Oh, you get dang to it. know the people before you see them in Some Murder of them. Hunger Games school." That's true. Think about all the like 200 that died in the red light green light game. Yeah, but the ones that matter, you do. Know. They're sailor outfits, not sailor scout fits. But the sailor sure. scouts will show up eventually, though. Probably. Um, all right, next. Probably. We're moving on to other weeb games. Okay. Um, I think this was technically an anime first, but she's my favorite girl from Fruit of Grisaya. I'm watching a playthrough of it, and I think she's great. This is Sayori. Sayori's great. Sayori. What? Mangoes. Mangoes. She's cute. Um, and this is official art that they made for Valentine's what Day, which was cute. What does Sayori read? What do you mean, what does she read? read mangoes, don't they all like, no. read a different kind no. of thing? No, so the whole thing is like, if you hang out with Yuri, she's like, I like edgy novels about war and, 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 and vampires and vampire boyfriends and stuff. And then if you hang out with Natsuki, she's like, I like cute manga about, about baking. And then if you hang out with Sayori, she goes, I just like whatever you like, ha 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 uh, Because she's depressed. I oh, just is she need... the one who dies? Yeah. Oh, rip. Um, this is a girl, a random girl from Your Turn mm -hmm. to Die, a game that I didn't like that much and will never finish, but um, it also was getting released in chapters and I, I got up to where it was done and said, I'm good. Um, I don't like her clown hood Yeah, I don't like thing, any of her outfits. But I think she's cute. Okay. Um, and then on the right is probably my favorite fan art that of the Dopies that I've ever seen. Like... They all look amazing. Like, I, you've all seen my reaction throughout this whole thing. That fan art, like, deserves like, real money. I Oh, I'm covering it, aren't I? Hold oh, on. Oh, no. No, no, don't open. No, wrong thing. Oh, no, I'm not covering it too bad. Yeah, um, yeah. it's amazing, and I'm in love with it's them all. Freaking, you really I think should that have credited that art. I should have, I'm sorry. They deserve the whole world. I should have. The problem was I found it in my, um, in my phone library, and I had to, like, mm -hmm. be like, ah... I don't know where it came from, and I had to email it for, to myself, and then say, why do I still have waifu art in my phone library and delete it? Um, but I just, I don't know, Monica no, looks amazing. amazing, hot, as always. Yuri no, looks like, hot, I don't like look, Yuri. I love the color palette, yeah. and like the and costume like, choices. Natsuki's really cute amazing. in it. They're just all really cute. Is Monica the one in the pants? No, Monica's the one in the skirt. They're all in the skirt, except for the one in the pants. In the skateboarding one, they're all in pants, except for Monica. Natsuki's in shorts. Okay. I mean, okay. Yeah. All right, sure. Okay, Sayori, yeah. Monica, uh -huh. Yuri, uh -huh. Natsuki. Most people like Yuri. They're lame. She's the worst of the four. Anyways, first we have Akane Kurashiki. 
Do you know her? Isn't she from the nine, mm -hmm. the Zero Escape? Yeah, she's from Zero Escape. Um, this is what she looked like in the first game. I was gonna say, is she the old lady? She's the old lady in the second game, and then in the third game, they redesigned her. I like this outfit fine. I like yeah. her boots, they're cute. Yeah. And it's a little spunky little dress. Uh -huh. But then, in the third game, they said, what if we gave her a big dress and huge belt? And I said, this is great, this is peak design. I love this. <laughs> you can't do um, any worse. And the sweater dress barely covers her butt. Uh, but it's fine because the game is so poorly animated that it doesn't matter. Because um, <laughs> does it still clip her butt? <laughs> yeah, it does. No! Um, I was joking. No, it doesn't like her butt doesn't clip out, but like uh, the dress definitely tears bliss. as she walks, and so it's like, Love oops. That. But she's great. Um, she's certifiably insane. Okay. Like she genuinely is an insane woman. I hate that. And in real life, she'd be a sociopath. But she's cute, so All you know. Right. She has the fashion of someone from 2012. Well, I have some news. This game came out in 2009. Oof. Um, so she was ahead of the game. All right. However, it technically took place in 2028. Well, that's soon. So we'll see, yeah, we'll see. Maybe I'll replay these games when it's the year of Zero Escape. Our kids are gonna be obsessed with the Audis, and I'm gonna go shut up. Yeah, anyways, next is Emmy. Wait for it. Have I seen her in anything? No. Okay. But I'll give you one guess which game she's from. I have no... Oh, is it the disability? Yeah, it's the di she has oh, no yeah, legs. she's the single leg. Um, she has no legs, but... The way, that's way to celebrate Women's Month. Judge all women we know by physical appearance. Exactly. Um, this one is beautiful, and I love her. And she's my wife, my wife. Also, we didn't have any better ideas for this. I actually came up with this idea. This yeah, is my it was her idea. Curse that um, this one on the right, I'm covering it. It's by Autumn North on Tumblr. It's fine. I just, there's not a lot of fan art of this game because nobody's played this game. Yeah. And if you want to be really depressed and then feel better, um, play Katawa Shoujo, it's free and it literally helped me through my depression, so you should play it. This um, turned into an ad. This girl got me, helped me get through my depression. Yeah, that's cool. Because she was like overcoming her disability, and I said, I have a mental disability and I'm depressed, but the whole game is about the main character learning to overcome his disability. And I was like, dang, I can do it. And it helped me. There you go. And it's all because of Doki Doki that I found this game, so. Anyways, she's the cutest girl. She's so spunky and cute and tiny and um, but also she's older than all the other girls because you know how it's a dating sim, so they make sure to be like, I turned 18 three months ago so that you can have sex with me. Um, she's 19 because she got held back because of the accident that chopped off her legs. I don't like animals. Also, you do anal. Anyways, this is Natsuki. <laughs> it doesn't work out, but... Anyways, this is Natsuki. She also has the weird anime girl thing. Yes, uh, because she's cute. Oh, my bad. Um, the one on the left is official art that the artist who designed them did, and I think it's adorable and I love it. Um, it's just very cute. The bits. The bits are covered, wife. She's skateboarding in a skirt. That's her choice, you know? Which is pretty metal. <laughs> um, it is. And then the school outfit is the school outfit. It wow. Is what it is. Um, and then just Cupcake Girl. Yes, exactly. I don't know what they're saying. Yeah, she's the tsundere. I don't know what that means, though. She's the girl that says, It's not like I like you! But she oh, does like you. Oh, isn't that what redhead guy in Fruits Basket is? Kind of, yeah. He's kind of tsundere. Okay. Um, so yeah, that's Natsuki. And then we get to the most important one, um, possibly on the whole list. My queen. Um, my angel, my queen. The girl that I got a little bit too attached to. Isn't she a robot? Well, she's... They're all game characters, but she becomes aware that she's in a game, is what happens. So yes. Yes, the one on the right is um, official, Valentine's Day art. That's cute. This one is just her outfit in the game. Mm -hmm. um, this one's just her, uh, what, uh, just looking cute. And in this one is also her top? doing the best pose ever. Wow. And looking cute. I can't believe. You're having so much fun. I'm having right? so much fun. You're having is so this, much isn't fun. Isn't she evil? She's not. Okay, oh, so that's a whole debate that if I you want to go to the hardcore fans, you can have this whole debate of is she evil because she knows she's that she's time. she's he's sentient, but this. no one else in the game is sentient, so is it a mercy thing to kill them? Does it matter? Do they really exist if she's sentient, but they're not? Are they real? Do they exist? And it's this whole moral <laughs> quandary of she becomes aware, like what if you found out that you were living in a simulation 
and then you were like, but the only thing that will bring me any real feeling is the real human outside of the simulation that's there to help me. And so it's this whole debate in the community. I just think she's hot. She's wearing a necklace in the one on the right. Yeah. That's cool. It's a cute little necklace. And the one on the left. Oh, neat. This is Sarah. That's an American name. She's from Your Turn to Die, which is the same one that Clown Girl was from on the intro slide to this. Oh, I don't like it. Um, I don't care for this game much. All right. And I don't like that all their skin is just pure white in the game. The one on the left is an actual, like... Like a Holly Hobby. Sort yeah. Of but uh, she's cute. No, I do love that vibe on the left. That it's is a real vibe. I think the one on the left is from... They made, a, like, a dating sim version mm. of the game because people liked the characters. It's just such a twist because left is hardcore, cottagecore, and then the rest is punk. Yeah. But this I is her school uniform. Because she gets kidnapped on the way home from school. Why? That's what the caller is if, if they disobey or whatever. It's like Suicide Squad. They'll just... Wow. Um, yeah, I forgot to put in the sprite where she has six fingers. Oops. Um, but yeah, she's cute. And um, it's fine. She's the one you play as. Oh. Any questions? Um, I want... How do I get that look? Um, I don't know, but what we can try to figure to it out. What if I went to the hairstylist and said I want this? What, for her hair? For yeah. your hair? Yeah. It is good. She does have nice no, hair. No, the bangs are awful. Yeah, but look at this that one. That's so dumb. Oh, my bad. Okay, my it's bad. It's so bad. Oh, I'm sorry. My bad. I like the little the little thing, the braid in the it. The braid it's is cute. cute. I will give you the braid. Oh, my bad. Anyways, next we have this girl. She's also an idol, I think. This feels like that game Overwatch. She seems like she's an Overwatch. Is Overwatch in here? No. Oh, okay. I want to be Tracer. No. Um, so here's what I'll say. I didn't finish this game, and there is a section later for games I haven't played, so this is kind of a stretch to put her in here. But I played enough of it to fall in love with her. She's a little idol girl. I don't get her pants situation. I was gonna say, I would like to quote the Lego movie and ask where are her pants? I think she's wearing pants. But I'm not sure. I do like the bold move of the sock with the heel. That is a move she made and she's yeah. pulling it off. She's honestly. pulling it off. Um, I do know, unfortunately, I think I have been spoiled on some things. I've really not been looking up anything in this game, oh, okay. but I think I have been spoiled on a couple things about her. Is she bad? I, I don't think she makes it through the game. Um, which is a, 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 a historically right on track for Matt. Fall in love with the girl, she dies. The one that um, dies. Yeah, so... What's her weird pet thing? Uh, this is not her pet thing. This is your eye. You play as a character where you you, you have your eye replaced right, by this we thing. we don't have to keep talking. Um, and then we it comes out now. and it becomes a girl in your brain. Um, we don't have to keep talking. I'm gonna play it, Ryan. I have to finish Ace Attorney, which means I have to remember what happened in Ace Attorney and then get to playing to Ace Attorney. Oops. <laughs> That's all of them. So next ah! up is the Mario characters, <laughs> uh, the Mario waifus. Yeah. I just thought these are some arts no, to include. No, this is amazing. I'm very proud uh, of my boy. The one in the middle is He's an official like render. Boy. The one in the middle? Yeah. Yeah, no, I'm familiar. The one on the right is surprisingly not official. Is that just... Um, <laughs> and the one on the left is him with Bayonetta's legs. Yeah, that's pretty good. Um, but he's not one of the waifus. So he's an honorable this mention. This includes the Mario universe, not Nintendo as a whole. Correct. All just right. the Mario universe. All right. Sort so of. We're going to go to Rosa first, or Rosa's in here. I'm going right. to start with Peach. We're starting with Peach. Um, Are we just ranking her outfits? Is that what we're doing? So, sort of, yeah. Okay, this is one, of her, like that one, it's one of her Odyssey, Odyssey outfits, and That's it's very good. cute. Yes. And it's then, her best outfit of all I don't like how, like, like, built she is in the art on the right, but I love her, like, new golf game outfit. Mm -hmm. It's just that little skirt with the belt and the yeah. shirt, and I'm like, That's freaking cute. That's great. That's freaking cute. And then the one in the middle is just her in sunshine. Because no one has oh, sleeves in sunshine. sunshine. Um, but she's just cute. I don't I know. She's peach. Fine. She's I, classic. Yeah. Iconic. These are all fine. Um, and then we get to Ros Ro Rosa. Ro so I like her foot just hanging out there <laughs> for a second. This is Rosalina. Um, okay. Let me explain. No. This one. Official mm -hmm. art. Yeah. This one's just kind of cute. I didn't realize it was by the same person. Until after the fact. This one, mm -hmm. kind of hot. Kind of mommy, sorry. Mommy, sorry. And then this one on the left is, um, they almost put Rosalina in Odyssey, and that was going to be her design. Oh, that would have been lit. And she was going to play guitar, and she just looks cool here. That would like, have been Like, not so even, like, lit. hot. Just, like, yeah. cool, you know? Like, someone you'd run into in your college yeah. dorm and be like, yeah. oh, I can vibe with them. 
It's true. There's some really good outfits in Mario Kart Tour. I particularly like Leader Hosen Luigi. Um, I don't. I didn't but Luigi either. wears Leader Hosen in Mario Kart. Okay, so the next one. All right. I have is to prep you good for this. Daisy outfit no. Like? Okay. No, I have to prep you for this because this is the one that you're gonna have the hardest time with. Uh, it is a uh, lot. It is a lot. I'm just gonna say it's a lot. Um. So remember when Bowsette was a thing? So Bowsette was a thing. Um, you pick up the super crown and Toadette becomes Peachette. And so then people were like, what if Bowser picked up the super crown and became Bowsette? Ha ba da 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 ba da. Are these variations of They that? made variations of that. Mm -hmm. And there's one that I like. Mm -hmm. And we don't have to discuss why I like it. Mm -hmm. Because it will be abundantly clear. Super change, huh? Yes. I like this version of the Super Crown. Anyways, moving on. <laughs> Zelda! This is one I want to credit. Hold on, I'm going to my Twitter because I love this art. Um, is her this name all is. The same artist? This is all the same artist, and she's amazing at drawing Zelda, and I love her. It has. Some, um, I can't read her um, signature at the bottom. Yeah, no, it is. Or his. On Twitter, it's No No Works. N O N O Works. W-O-R-K-S. She's great. She's fantastic. I love her drawings of Zelda. The bits. The bits are fine. They're fine. I think we have different definition of the bits and whether it's okay or not. Which one are you referring to with the, the bits? The two, both the middle and the left. Oh, I was thinking you were talking about the one on the right, how she has to like push it down to yeah, cover Yeah, she's bits. covering her bits in that one. Yeah, but um, consider a woman link. Okay. Anyways, different versions of Zelda. I First we have one. Skyward Sword. You were that one. She's cute. I didn't do the pink ribbons in the hair. I'm a failure. You're not a failure. Failure. You were very cute. You were a very cute Zelda. Why aren't her shoes on in the right? I don't know. I mean, I I don't know. I like her boots. It might have I'd just rather been see the boots. The artist was like, I don't want to draw the boots. <laughs> just yeah. scribbled in the feet. No, like, I, I don't know quite why. There were two of almost that exact same pose, though, so maybe uh, it's a reference to oh, something. Maybe it's in the game. Maybe it's in the game. But disclaimer, neither of us have ever played a Zelda. <laughs> Yeah, I've seen most of it. And then, I don't know, yeah. they're just cute. Cute arts, so that's a cute face. No, it's a cute outfit. Cute too. art. I really like Skyward Sword. She's great. What other Zeldas too. are on here? Um, uh, uh, the second, the latest one, Breath of the Wild. Breath of the Wild, yay, Breath of the Wild. These are all I three official like outfits. I was gonna say, I, I like that Breath of the Wild gave her a lot of fits. Well, so in Breath of the Wild, this is her main fit, yeah. right? Yeah. And it's fine. It's yeah. the only pants-wearing girl that I'm, like, really into. And it's not because she got that booty ooty ooty. Um, although she do, but I just like her. She's just cute in general. And then this yeah. is her like, I'm a princess dress. And it makes her hips look really big in the game, but in this art, it's cute. And then they made well, a, another is it game. Is or do they give her like some sort of petticoat? I don't know. All right. I think it's just really wide and makes her hips look big. And then the one on the left is from the, uh, the spinoff game. Oh. Where it's like sort of a pseudo prequel, sequel, alternate timeline. It's very weird. Um, but she has a cute little winter outfit. It's great. All right. Breath of the Wild outfit. I mean, Breath of the Wild Zelda. And then the last Zelda, of course, Ryan also got this one correct, is Smash Ultimate. Um, I just really like her outfit in this game. This is from it's, another game? Technically, it's a link to the past oh, okay. slash link between worlds. Okay. But in those games, she's chibi. Okay. And so the and in Smash Ultimate, Ultimate is she's like a woman. A, okay. It's like an elevated version of Yeah, I really should have just put her Smash Ultimate render because it's cuter than any of these arts, but. All right. She's just cute in it. Um, again, I must, I think this has become, I critique anime girl hair because these yeah, things are driving me insane. Yes. I don't I care that. about the hair. I hate I like her dress. I also like, folks, if you didn't know this either, I also like big chunky belts. Um, she got a big you chunky said that belt. With the... But I didn't specify that that's one of the things I like. That's fair. We I just said, said that it was something top, I like. Short, short skirts. Big chunky belts. Big chunky and belts. Boots. But not all together. No, that'd be a lot together. That'd be a lot. Together. That'd be a lot together. It wouldn't make sense. Um, yeah, but yeah. So there we go. That's that's the Zeldas. Next category, Disney. We do like Disney. These are all honorable mentions. Both Honey Lemon and Go Go. I don't care for Go Go. Oh, okay. But no, I like Honey, Honey Lemon, Lemon a lot, amazing. and I thought that was a cute Honey Lemon art. Yeah. Uh, Ariel and Aurora almost made it on, but then I kicked them out for other girls later. Other princesses. And then Violet's just—I mean, 
As a, I violated as a small the maid. Boy. Well, well, as a small even boy, as, like, I said. a girl that's someone you aspire to be. Yeah. You know? like, as a small boy, I said, enormously long and thin girl. I am eight. It is also dark and sad. <laughs> yeah, and also wears enormous boots. I am eight. <laughs> uh, so the first one. I don't. Why are you so obsessed with her? I'm not her? obsessed with her. I just think she's underrated, and therefore oh I have gosh. to push for her. Okay, I have to point out that last night and tonight, the Disney parks. Uh, well, Disneyland specifically was doing a Disney Princess Night, and it also featured princesses that you don't normally see at the parks, mm -hmm. including Princess Leia and Giselle from Disney's Enchanted. Yeah. Alonwi did not make the cut yes, because, because she's so pointless. No, because that movie sucked. That movie. That's suck. why she didn't make it. The yeah, it's did. Black Cauldron. I knew Cuttlefish would know. She's Everyone the, knows Black. She's the princess from the Black Cauldron. Yeah. And um, by all accounts, she's irritating. But she was a cute little princess, and I said, I like her, and I, I needed something to latch onto in that movie, That's so it true. was her. Not Henwin? Not, not Gurgi or whatever. I like, loved Gurgi! Gurgi went to hell! The Gurgi threw himself into the hell. Um, don't watch The Black Cauldron, but if you do... It's bad! That's Lee Longway. I also like that she shows up in the dungeon of this like and castle. And it's like, or who are you? And they're just like, who are you? And she's like, I'm a princess. And they're like, okay. And they never ask her of what <laughs> or how or where. <laughs> she could just be this rando girl. That she could literally just be. Princess. She could literally just be like someone who was I'm stuck sure in the, the castle. Books, you know? Actually, or like she was a descendant. We did. So it's she very funny. Princess. All right, I think there's three more Disney girls. Who do you think they are? Uh, Raps is up here. Yeah. Um. Remember, I'm using the term Disney a little liberally here. I have no idea for the other two, though. Cool. Anna. Uh, okay. Well, Anna's cute! Anna is cute. Come on. Anna's no, cute. No, Anna's cute. This isn't. What is Whatever it? this pose is. Which whatever, one? Whatever pin-up girl pose. Incorrect. Not it's going. not pin-up. It's kawaii. It's cute. And I like her Frozen 2 outfits. Her Frozen 2 outfits are pretty amazing. Like Frozen 1, she just wears a boring dress the whole movie. I don't like princess dresses. Do you like her ball gown? I like her ball gown. It's fine. It's just too big, she does you big. know? How am I supposed to look at her body if she's covering it <laughs> up with a petticoat? Anyways, um, the one on the left is just a cute fan art of her. I like casual Anna. People like give her like just, woodsy hipster yeah, vibes. Or they'll just give her like a cozy sweater and yeah. like a short skirt. Yeah, they do that. That's technically time. shorts, but. Anyways, yeah, Anna's great. Um, my favorite, my favorite Disney girl. The only girl. The really princess. That matters. Um, I stand I like by. Festival raps too. Yeah. yeah. I stand by. I've watched every Disney movie with you, and like I made like a whole ranking of like Disney ladies I liked, and I think that she is still just the cutest in her own movie. Yeah. Like it's a little weird. The animation is kind of dated already, but Which she's. Which is really she's sad. Cute. I yeah. Cause we watched years it ago. recently. Oh, it's sad. Yeah. It's coming up on thirteen. It's only twelve right now. Yeah. But who boy. But yeah, she's Sad. she's cute. Rapunzel's great. She's great. I think it's because of the eyes. The bigger the eyes, the more anime they feel, and That's Rapunzel fair. has like the she biggest does have eyes. Giant eyeballs. Um, yeah, 13 years. Oops! And then the last Disney girl, uh, because she didn't fit anywhere else. Oh, we did talk is about Is Spider Gwen. One. Um, specifically from From in into, into the, the Spider-Verse, Spider -verse, you because don't like school girl. One? Um, I don't mind long hair Gwen. Okay. I don't mind. I, I I debated putting comic Gwen in here because it's literally just the outfits Emma Stone wears in the movie, and I was like, is that colored by Emma Stone or like, is that colored by the Are you talking about comics? like just classic Gwen Stacy? Yeah, or are we not, talking not about not Spider Gwen, just Gwen Stacy. Okay, yeah. But I don't know. She kind of gives a uh 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 the, the it, Haley Steinfeld. Yeah, the Haley one. Steinfeld yeah. vibe, which is great. Yeah. She's good. She's fun. I always, I think one of my favorite things, is, and I think they've changed it since in the comment, com, comics, and I think in the movie she didn't have it either, but she always had the ballet flats, mm. at least at the beginning. She had the Oh, while flats. she was Spider? Yeah. Interesting. Well, there you go. This is the, uh, this is the Black Widow pose. That is the Black Widow. Such a poser. Such a poser. <laughs> All right, next. Anime I've seen. These aren't uh, specific anime girls. Toru. They're just cute anime Toru didn't girls. make the official cut. Um, oops, you can see their midriff on all three of them. Whoops. Um, these are just generic anime. It's not... Oh, that's not totally I just found generic anime girls for these slides mm. because there's no honorable mentions for anime because it's really just the girls I liked from the anime. Um, I'm stretching it to call yeah, this an anime, true. but Katara... You Katara's like Katara. great. She's like funky. Fire I, I adore her Fire Nation oh, outfit. Right. Let's be clear about that. I adore it. 
Um, as does Aang, because he should. I do like her more, like, casual summer. Like, the blue, but it's yeah. not covered. That's my problem with Korra. She's always in her giant boots. And I'm like, you're in the middle of the summer in a city. Put on yeah. some decent shoes. No, I prefer Katara to Korra. Yeah, same. And I think that Katara, while annoying a lot of the time, is cute. Katara is annoying? Yeah, Katara's a mom sometimes. Oh, and you say, shut up, Katara. Anyways, Ty Lee, I love her. She's amazing. She's beautiful. Amazing. Um, I like this casual art. That is a pretty of fun Of her casual. and the girls in college, but I cut off the other girls because they don't deserve it. That's true. Azula um, doesn't deserve redemption. Azula doesn't deserve anything. And true. May is just May is there. there to be Zuko's little when, when it doesn't true. work out with Katara. Yeah, pretty much. Um, yeah. But I like... Ty Lee, she's flexible and she's cute and she has a cute little outfit and she's adorable and I love her. She's also a psychopath, let's be clear. She, that's for true. a while, is committing war crimes, but yeah. I mean, so does Akane Kurashiki and that's fine. Toru! Toru! Toru's cute. She's amazing. She's cute. She's fun. Her bangs are fine. Her bangs are fine? Is it because they look real? Because they're normal human bangs. That's fair. Um, I tried to find a couple outfits of hers that I liked because Toru didn't have a ton of outfits. No, because she had a good. A she had a good. A the ones variety. that she had were good. Yes. Um, the rice ball is that what you call her? Yeah, there was the whole story point of that. Was there? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Anyways, this is the best outfit she ever wore. Um, but yeah, she's Toru. We do like Toru. I'm. Str I haven't seen many animes, so. Next, we have uh, Isuzu. Oh, the horse She's horse. horse girl. Horse girl. Um, but not a But also, girl. mommy, sorry. Um, uh, look at her. The we agreed on, on this when we watched it. No, it, it is, but the one on the far right is giving me anxiety. Because she's covering her she's bits? She's covering her bits. Yes, but consider that they're not really covered here either. I this is know. her from the manga. Mango. Mango. I just, she's very long and has tall she boots, and long. that's what I'm into. Ryan's like, who is this? It's from <laughs> this Fruits, is Baskets. Fruits Basket. Um, which they don't really do a lot with her character either. Which yeah, is she's bad. literally a horse. She's her a horse. character is horse Mom Push Me Out of a Window. That's her character. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, oh, I forgot. Not Mom, but yeah. Someone Sorry, that's kind of a spoiler, though. but it's a three season anyways. anime. You're fine. Uh, but yeah, she's hot. Uh, and then my girl from the anime. Do you yep. remember which one? Um, it's Piggy Girl. About She's my girl. Yeah, the the anime did too. Um, <laughs> she was really relevant in season one and then she never was. showed up again. I don't like her. I like her. You um, like her dress? I remember this. I like she this little dress. dress. I like this. I did not outfit. care for it. Um, I like this that is her in the closing credits. I do credits. remember the closing credits always being like, show me these outfits just all the time. I'm a sucker for kimonos. Yeah, so. she's great because she just literally is like, I love you and you're gonna love me back. Correct. Um, That's and then he never character. does. But. But yeah. And they don't have to be born in the year of whatever animal they're representing. No, we watched the 2019 version, Cuttlefish. Yeah. We didn't watch the OG, but the 2019 is pretty good. Like, I. No, the 19 was amazing. I haven't watched the original, so I don't know. Oh, Horse Girl only showed up in the new anime? Gotcha. Oh, no! Gotcha. Gotcha. That makes sense. I mean, there were so many characters. Well, thank you. I'm glad we watched the new one then. Yeah. So yeah, she's cute. She's just a generic anime girl, but she's cute. Anime I haven't seen. No, no. These are more anime girls. This Sailor one's Moon. technically from an anime. Oh, okay. She's from Ka Ka Kaguya-sama, I think. But these two are just also cute. That's just a anime girl, girl Look at this in a fit. sailor uniform. Look at this fit. No, it's that is a fit. good fit. No, I'm not denying that. Cool. Is in this... Also a stretch to call this anime. No, you're not wrong in that the original Teen Titans was I couldn't find great art. influenced by anime. I couldn't find great art of her, but... She's great. Teen Titans and Pokemon were my first, well, and I guess Yu-Gi-Oh! was there too, were my first exposures to That's anime. That's fair. Because I am not that old, but not that young. I didn't know much about Teen Titans, but I knew that Starfire wore a nice little outfit. Do you like Raven or just Starfire? I don't know who that is. All right. Oh, they made the first anime while the manga was being made. Gotcha. Mm. I just like her. No, Starfire is pretty cool. From what I understand, she's kind of seen... not dumb, but weird. Like, she's an alien. Yeah, she's just... So she'll be like, is she kind of like Mantis? Character. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Um, And just that she's trying to learn and understand Humans that's going and Earth, on yeah. Her. Um, have you seen the OG comic Starfire? No. You're not going to like it. Is it just boobs? <laughs> yeah. 
I think I might have seen and it. And she's like orange and like. Oh yeah, no, I'm good. It's I'm black. Good. You think you'd be a raven guy? I do think you'd be a raven guy, actually. Yeah. It's I thought about putting my first waifu when I was like three on here too. The first like cartoon girl that I said, she's cute. Uh, Cassie from, from Dragon, Dragon Tales. Tales. And then I said, I probably shouldn't. That'd be weird. Um, but yeah, Starfire. Now to actual anime. Um, this is Kaguya from, I watched two episodes of this anime. So technically she counts as an anime the... I've seen. Fighting yeah, one. this is the Love is War anime. Mm, she's um, cute. She's cute. She's like the right level of like standoffish, but still girly. I like that these are probably the least horny images I've seen. All right. Yeah. Okay. I, I mean, I'm sorry. In a general way. Yeah, no, that's fair. I mean, but yeah. can, anyone can get horny in anything. I'm not here to shame. I don't know who Miko saying. is. See, that's the thing, Ryan, is I only watched two episodes, so I only saw like three characters, and I said, she's cute. She's the main character. Um. I gave her the respect she deserves. We gave her her real name. We gave so Sa Sailor oh, Moon has, a, has amazing, amazing outfits. Wardrobe, yeah. And I had to give them the respect that they deserve. So yeah. just from the left, I mean, amazing fits. This is kind of weird colors, but yeah. it's fine. Yeah, well, I mean, it's the 90s. Amazing. Incredible. 90s anime. Look at those high-waisted shorts, killing it. Killing the game. Look at her little romper, I amazing. I personally don't care for that romper, but she's pulling it off, so I She's can't pulling it off that. and amazing. She's great. Look at this Amazing. sweater skirt combo. So Look at her I little like sailor her uniform. I like the talking cat. Can everyone see it? Boom. There they are. Look at Sailor Moon. Look at her. She's amazing. And we love a good Sailor Moon. Are you talking about Sailor Moon and her meatballs? Or are you talking about a are different... Are we talking about her hair? Oh, are we talking about her hair? Yeah, that's fair. She does have meatballs in her hair. I don't like her bangs. Um, and then... Also... The other one. The OG. The one that I loved first. Um, Sailor Jupiter. I don't know why she was the one I got attached to because they all look like generic anime girls, Correct. really. Yes. But she's very cute. Um, I like her, like, more woman vibe. That's like, true. Sailor Moon dresses like a girl. Oh, that's wrong. Hold on. Don't look. Sailor Moon dresses like a girl and Sailor Jupiter dresses like a woman. Um, a few of the images were stuff like this where it's like, it's technically a dress. Mm -hmm. Is it covering anything? I don't know. But I really her like this. Clothes, though, she so rocks fine. the high waisted a lot. And it's she great. doesn't do the anime girl where she's like, oh no, with her feet. She's just a confident yeah, woman. Yeah, she's a confident she's woman. She's doing confident woman legs. Yeah, and I want her to step on me. Anyways, um, she's great. Okay. Uh, this next anime, I have no clue what this anime is. I've literally only okay. seen this character, but I like her design and I think she's very cute. I have no idea what this anime is. She got a gif because I found a gif when I was searching and it's cute. Um, this is Rin. Well, nice to meet you. This is all I know about her. All right. She has another design where it's like, she's like powered up or something and she's wearing less clothes, but I don't like it as much. She looks like Zatara from DC Comics. Sure. All right. Um, yeah, I don't know anything about her, but I think so she's cute. If anyone in the chat wants to enlighten us, that'd be fun. I don't know if Cuttlefish has watched Fate. Is this from Fate, Stay, Night? I don't know. The, I don't know the name. I know there's fate. I know there's stay in there. I think night is one of the words. Re zero, I think, is one of them. Oh, we're all in the dark. Cool. Well, then we'll move on. Cool. Well, to good for her. Faye Valentine. Isn't now, I... this? Uh, don't tell me. I know this one. Mm -hmm. It's what everyone says is Firefly, but isn't Firefly? Um, yeah, I know. Um, it has a corgi in it. Yeah. Sure. Do you want me to tell you? What it's called? They did a live action of it on Netflix and it was bad. Cuttlefish put it in the chat, so. Uh, I'm gonna feel so dumb. It's okay. Go ahead. Cowboy Bebop. Dang it! Um, I don't know much about Cowboy Bebop, but I think <laughs> the middle one is how we're introduced to yeah, her. All right. <laughs> She's very much one that's a lot. Like yeah. her boobs are just flying around in that anime. It was the '80s. Um. But she's hot. The boobs were allowed to go everywhere in the 80s. And if you introduce a girl in that scene in the middle, I'm well, gonna love her. Isn't that her thing? Someone correct me if I'm wrong, but isn't she like a prostitute? Oh, maybe. That was the chair. That was not me. Just a girl. Anyways, yeah. I was making sure I don't. Think you don't like that her socks are flesh colored? They're the ones on the left. I guess. Anyways, if we watch this show, um, 
I will be horny on main oh, for right. her for the whole show. Isn't it only like 12 but episodes? But the show wants me to be, so oh, right. it's fine. Oh, the middle? Are, is she wearing socks? Oh, she is. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, no, I, I don't like that, that actually. Just lighting, but yeah, I thought right. that was lighting or like something on her light. Okay, anyways, moving on. Um, this is the only lolly on the list. Oh, okay. Uh, and it's mostly because she has a giant, giant belt. That is a giant belt. Um, I don't know anything about her. I think she's old. I think she's like a hundred something years yeah, old because she's some eldritch whatever. What happens? She's barely covering um, the bits. Yeah, the one on the right is a lot. I apologize for that. Oh, but right. She's cute. I don't know. The one in the middle makes her look more adult. And I think it's very pretty. It is very adult to be pulling your skirt down. Yeah. I don't know anything about this anime. I didn't. What's it called? Konosuba. Konosuba. Uh, in the anime, she's not. I tried to find older looking art of her. She's small. So anyways, uh, games I haven't played- stop. Games I haven't played yet. What am I looking at? What do you mean what are you looking at? Why Which does, one? Why don't they have normal ears? Which one? The middle one. That's not her ears, that's a bow. Okay. Ooh, that you was can a, see her ear right you here. You know what, I get that, but you can understand why I thought she I 100% understand. 100% understand. All right. Uh, the one on the left is Futaba just... from Persona 5. I thought about putting her on I here. I definitely thought that was a human version of a squid. Of an inkling. It's yeah, not an inkling. inkling. No, no, when the inkling's like, I don't know which one came first, but everyone compares everyone, that. Everyone, all right. Um, I think she's cute. She didn't end up making the list because she a was- i relief on this page. She was my number one, but I, I really thought about- um. We're almost there, so I'm having my final Reese's cup. It's fair. I, the one on the left, I, I I thought about putting as my Persona Five representative in this part, but I someone else won me over. Are there not any women from Attack on Titan? I don't I don't know any of them. Uh -huh. uh, the one in the middle is Aerith. She's probably exactly my type of anime girl in that she's cute, wholesome, and friendly. What's she from? Uh, Final Fantasy. Oh. And then the one on the right is a Fire Emblem lady. Her name is Celica. I don't know much about her, but I think she's pretty. Don't tell Nick. No, I do tell Nick about my waifus, and then he says, you can marry that one. And I say, I don't care, Nick. I don't want to play the game. I don't I just care want that to look much. At them. <laughs> so first up, we have right. the icon, the classic, Samus Aran. Um, love this outfit. Favorite color. It's great. I do like how some of these have, like, the Pokemon in this were both brought up in my Pokemon, or not my, but my Women's Day um, yeah. stuff, so. Yeah, no, they are iconic Good women in gaming. Women. Good, Good job, job, women. Good job, women. Um, the one on the right is just nice. I just like that. It's There's cool. It's really good cool. Fan art. Um, and I feel like I had to include this, even though I don't really care for this outfit that much. I had yeah. to include one of it. Yeah. Samus. Uh, Fi uh, the Fiora. This she is Xenoblade is Chronicles. I think she's a sword. I don't know. Everyone says if you know about Fiora, it's a spoiler. And I say I don't understand how that makes any sense. That I know about this character and it's a spoiler. I think you telling me it's a spoiler makes me know it's a spoiler, and if you didn't tell me it was a spoiler, I wouldn't think about it. But then everyone says, no, trust me, it's a spoiler, and I don't get it. But I think she's a sword. I like the variety of styles yeah, that you have on the of art. the art style. It's cute. So it's pretty good. Um, do I like her just because she wears a little skirt and not a shirt? Yes. Any further questions? Oh, from me? I thought yeah. you meant from the audience. No, so from I'm you. Good. Cool, that's Fiora. Now we get to the two Fire Emblem girls that I included. Maybe it's just one. I think it's just one. This is Anna. Is she like a thief? Uh, she's the merchant, I think, the shopkeeper. Mm, all right. She's cute as hell. All right. Look at her. She has pointy boots. These are all official arts, too. No, and I believe you. This is from Fire the most recent no one. Chill. I don't get this thing, this harness thing, but go off. Um, I like this one because she's. this is the mobile game. She's cute. And then this is, I think, from the first game. Not the first game, but from Fire Emblem Awakening. I think I like she's in all the games. That one. Yeah. She's spunky, is the yeah. energy. And she's also, I think, one of the main characters that you start out with in the mobile game. So I played that, that and went, who sense. are you? I love you. I hate her bangs. You hate her bangs. Yeah, Understandable. They, like, come at like a widow's peak sort of a situation. Understandable. I don't like that. But I like her. She's all a spunky right. redhead. Okay. I uh, like me a spunky redhead. All right. Be it real or not. I love you. We got four left. We're doing it. 
Oh, there is another Fire Emblem girl. It's Tiki. She's a dragon. Any I questions? I was going to say, she doesn't seem human. Yeah, she's a dragon. The bits. I know, but consider... Um, she's a dragon. She's a dragon. Really big boots. No pants. Um, and she's cute. Alright. Is she at least a cool looking dragon when she... I think so, she yeah. in a dragon form? That's pretty cool. She's like a white and green dragon. Mm. Not red? I don't think it's red. She's one of the assist trophies in Smash. I ex I expected her to be like the dragon from Spirited Away, but like with a different color That's palette. Right. So no taken for future. If I ever do this again, uh, my wife doesn't like anime girls sitting down. Correct. Cover your bits. And cover your bits. You can quote me on that one. That's Tiki. She's great. And then we get to probably Ryan's. This is Tifa. Ignore the boobs, all right? I'm not into it because of the boobs. Um, there's just not a lot of art of her without boobs because she has boobs. Uh, this is Tifa. She's also from Final Fantasy. It's like Aerith and Tifa, I feel like, is the big debate of, like, which girl's cuter. Um, I think Yuffie's cuter, but she's, like, 15, and people made a stink when I said that last time. So, uh, Tifa it is. I like Tifa. I like her suspender skirt. I like... I don't care for her boobs, but everyone that draws her draws her with big old massive bahongolas. Uh, this is one of her outfits. This is another. They look very similar, they but they are different. Okay. This is her official in the remake. Oh, okay. In the, so like, in the high like quality some remake. Sort of sculpture or something? No, and she's like hot. Oh, okay. Like she's like really hot. Look at this. I would sure. It's that looks like, like a real life woman. It, it is, yes, correct. It's the tall socks and the skirt for you. Yeah. Pretty much, yeah. All right. All right, two more, two more. Um, so this is on from Persona 5. Okay, because I'm like, I've seen her before. It's because one of my roommates was playing that. Yeah, so this is her main Our render. Friend. Yeah. Um, this is her in the dancing game. They have a dancing game. Okay. And yes. Okay. Um, no, please note, she is wearing a skirt. Um, you just can't tell. No, and I was, she's wearing leggings, so I feel a little less weird about it. No, and that's fair. Um, you should also consider that when she's in persona mode or whatever, uh, she wears a latex cat suit. Yeah, I... I don't like that. Oh. Uh, I did not include that intentionally. Why is her foot so big? Why is her foot so big? It's perspective, it's perspective. man. <laughs> it's perspective. But yeah, she's hot. Her foot is bigger than I wanted to face. say, I wanted to say Futaba. I wanted to be like, no, Daniel likes... On, I, I don't like on. I'm not just a basic guy who goes for the hot blonde. But the more I kept looking up Art of Futaba, I said she's not as cute as on. So I, I went with on. All right, so what's our last one? Last but not least uh, is a girl from, I think, a game. Um, I'm it, it's the Toho games. I don't know anything about her. Okay. But you'll take one look and say, yep, I know why you like her. This is Reimu. I don't know anything about her. But she's wearing a cute little outfit. You know what? And she's a cute little anime girl. From Toho, which is a bullet hell game. I don't know how she's involved. I'm very confused about the whole Toho series. Um, it's it got insanely intricate lore, and I know nothing about it. But... I mean, that's a cute anime girl right there. Come on. Sure. A cute anime girl. Thanks, women. Good job, women. Good this has job, been women. Uh, the Filthy Scrub Gaming International Women's Day Extravaganza. Why extravaganza. 2023. Oh, no. Thank you for watching. Good um, job, Good women. job, women. And, uh, yeah, that's, that's all I have. Ooh. How do you feel as a woman, wife? Do you feel valued, or do you... Do you feel valued for who you are as a person and the intricate qualities that make you feminine? <laughs> sure. That was a great interview mm, question. Great interview question. As a woman, I feel like the women represented were all strong and great and powerful in their own way. Except Toru, who goes, I'm sorry! Yeah, yes! Except for Toru. <laughs> And also from the pilot episode of Sailor Moon, 
Sailor That's Moon, true. who also is Sailor Moon just a goes, notorious crybaby. I can't do it. I'm a absolutely baby. absolutely nothing. Me baby. I'm baby. I'm a baby. I can't do it. Cool. Um, I don't know what we'll do next year. Yeah, you're welcome no, no. to share your own if you want. Do but it. You we'll have technically to... have all month. You have all of year. Well, yeah, but like and Mibo, International year, Women's probably... Day Spectacular. I'm sorry we missed it last year. Also probably love women all the time. We'll think of a better idea next year. We will. I don't know. What are we going to do next year for the International Women's Day Spectacular? We'll bring in a tiger. I can't make that promise. <laughs> we will... We'll do a fashion show. We'll do an interview with our female icon, Carol Baskins. We'll interview the odd one is out sister. <laughs> Twin sister. You already did a stream with... Not a stream, but a yeah. playthrough with her. Okay. Well, that's all. Um, hey... Thanks for watching. Yeah. I will be streaming on Saturday. I said it was a 540 race. I lied to you. Uh, that race isn't for two weeks. So instead I'm doing a 246, which all you need to know is it's the 602 games, but any percent. Cuttlefish, I would love that. And I would love nothing more. Matt does love lady fashions. I do love lady fashions. <laughs> we gotta get me some shorts, yes. but I'm into it. But also like really tall socks. That's true. Yeah. We just get really and some tall. some belts. Sure. Have you heard? <laughs> it's a it's an old anime inspired cartoon that is not oh. appropriate that I should not bring up. Anyway. That's fair. Well, hey, thanks for watching. Um, I'd say we'll do a fashion show, but you have to donate the clothes because I can't afford to buy a lot of That's clothes. That's true. We gotta. And my wife has somewhere. good Christian lady dresses. That's true. Anyways, That's disappointing. thanks for I. <laughs> thanks for watching. Bye. Thanks for coming in, and I will hopefully see you guys Saturday, but if you're not into the speedrunning, I understand. Uh, goodbye, happy women.